Welcome back to What Arty Nibs with General Disturbance. This is the second of the Arty Day competition runners up. Uh, it's a Lloyd Gun Carriage, the Tier 2 British SPG. It's located on the north spawn of Abbey and it's under the command of General Disturbance. Yes, another one of mine's. Um, and this time in the Lloyd Gun Carriage, the British one. And, um, well, let's see how I get on with this game. Game started. Okay, well, game started and I'm aiming towards the Abbey grounds. Expecting some early arrivals. Our guys are almost going to be on the uh, main strip on the, the street leading up to the Abbey. Up, oh, somebody's turned up. Now I'm re aiming, but I got a big rescue bloom when I did because the vehicle moved. And therefore, I'm trying to get a shot. Dial in on that Cruiser 3. And the M2 light goes around the corner. And I can't shoot the Cruiser 3 now because he's gone behind the building. And the M2 light's no longer in sight. So I'm holding on this position for the moment. And there's the M2 light. He comes back again. The vehicle moves. So I've got a bit of record bloom again. Trying to get the aim to settle on him. Frustrating, I've lost that M2, but we've got two tanks turn up on the uh, river road. It's 10 TP, and he's wiped out, and now we've got a T26. And he kills the M2 light. I fire around in and take out the T26. So, first kill. And a Geschutzpanzer Mark 6E has turned up in the village. I don't think he's going to last very long, then. Wrong place for that guy. Should be at the back of the map. Because he's got the range to shoot over the entire range. There's Cruiser 3. I fire just ahead of his travel. And he pulls back. Fire another round in at him. And no, he's no longer there. Ah, there he is. And again, if you adjust the vehicle, adjust the aim, you suddenly lose um, a lot of the... Um, all the dialing in that you've done. Oh, he's somewhere in there because the tree just went down. Oh, I can see some damage. There he is. I fire a quick round at him. Ah, oh, didn't get the kill. Strip 38 got the kill there. Still waiting for that M2 light to appear. I think he's sitting behind that house. And he's very reluctant to come out. Now, he might be on his side, actually. Oh, no, he's not. There he is. Round out. Oh, and that's a wipeout. Yep, he appeared. Okay, so there's only five enemies left. I need to get closer because they're just out of range. Gonna go down the edge. And we're off. Now I'm hoping I'll be able to get close enough to get some shots on these enemy. It's a bit dangerous in this RT to get too close because you might become target. And I'm just too far away to get shots on the guy at the edge. Let's see if I can sit behind this wreck. That should be close enough. And there's an R35. Right, I can dial in on him. Marked him as target. He is taking fire. Oh, and he's gone. Okay, well, there's a Polish tank just behind there. This Polish tank destroyer. The Pulv M42. Fire a blank round in and nope. I think the Marda 2 is there as well. I'm pretty sure he'd be in that bush. If he's not there, I wonder if he's moved to that one. Nope, he's not there. Well, having a look where we think the Marder 2 might be. Oh, we found him. There he is. Marked him. Round out. Direct hit. 147 hit points. He's wiped out a second or so later. And uh, we've still got that Polish tank destroyer and two other tanks that we haven't seen. Including, well, one of them is an Arty. 
No, still trying for that bush. Feel sure he might be around there somewhere. I'm going to have a blind fire on the other bushes. I've got enough rounds. No. There he is. He was behind one of those bushes. Just a little too far back for me to hit, though. And I think that strip's going to get him. Yep. And unfortunately, we lost the strip because there was an enemy tank nearby, a cruiser, too. And with him is the Lorraine 39 LAM. So I'm racing as far south as I can get. Cruiser 2's down. Now, can I get this Lorraine? He's within range now. Going for it. Dialing in. Trying to get it in time. Oh, and it's killed before I can get there. So, game over. Let's have a look at the end of battle stats for this one. Well, this one, funnily enough, was a first-class tanker, and surprisingly, the win eight was higher than the previous battle. 3,367 out of that one, even though I only got two kills out of it. Um, funnily enough, I did get the highest damage on my team. I didn't get the highest damage overall. That went to the Marder 2. He got 541 hit points of damage. I got 402, and then got the uh, uh, the T-29 on our team with 394. He also managed to get five kills, uh, we've got the Striv M38 got three, so did the Marder 2, and I only managed to get two kills in the end. But the base XP was 311. Now, actually, I thought that was the same as the previous score from the FTBS. Actually, that was 310. So, uh, although surprisingly they were close, and I thought there was two games with the same base XP, no, not quite. They were slightly out. Um, Shots fired 13, three direct hits, three penetrations, one splash, 402 hit points of damage, all at more than 300. Uh, three enemy vehicles damaged, two destroyed, and uh, 9,684 credits earned. And after ammo resupply, 9138 taken away. 25 bonds, I got the Veni Vidi Vici out of that one. And 466 XP times two, 466 extra for 100%. And took away 1399, but the 311 wasn't good enough to win, so it's a run another runner up video. So, uh, thanks for watching this one, and I'll be along with the next replay for the runner ups very shortly.